right, in this video I'm going to show you how to set up uh, some mobile WordPress themes. Um, you can do as many as you want, customize them, and how I do it is I use Artist here. I tried using some other themes and um, I've actually manipulated the code and that's pretty time consuming and painful, especially if you miss one little thing, it can screw everything up. So I uh, just use Artist here, which is a pretty cool program and it lets me design WordPress sites and it also lets me do mobile WordPress sites which I really like so um, basically all I do is I'll go out and I'll find a list of uh, companies that I want to hit up for for a day and I'll actually go out and visit them and I'll build themes before I go so what I'll do is I go in and I'll find uh, their website or sometimes they won't have a website and they'll have their logo on Facebook or whatever but I typically try and find something with their logo on it view their image then I save it and once I have it saved I want to come in and I want to make sure that it's no more than 250 pixels wide okay so this one is 190 by 84 and we want to remember that number so 190 by 84 all right so then we come in here to artist here click right on the header and we'll select from file and we'll go down and we'll select our thing and right there it is uh, way too big so what we want to do is we want to come over to the height and it was 84 pixels tall so we want to make it, I am usually make it about 10 pixels larger. So you have about 5 on top and 5 on the bottom. Come in here to position, click on 100%, boom, it puts it right in the middle. Alright, now that we have that, what we want to do is um, go to the background color and I actually want to change this uh, to make it more appealing and we'll select fill color more colors drop this down here and um, we'll go right in and select a color from the uh, background right there select OK and we'll want to change this color in the menu as well so same thing more colors and We'll select this color right here okay and there we are we're good to go as far as the logo goes now what we want to do is uh, make sure that we get it the right size so what we'll do is we'll go here to our sheet or our articles actually our yes yeah, sheet go to the sheet go to width and you want to make sure you use the fluid not the fixed and I'll show you the difference so we'll go fixed and we'll start closing this down while I'm here and you can see everything on here stays the same right so what we want to do is select select the fluid width you usually go with the hundred and we also want to go in and more sheet widths and set the minimum width down to 300 because that's about as big as a screen is going to be on a smartphone so when we shrink this down to size you see all the text how it just keeps shrinking perfect and once we have that set up all we have to do is go to our thing here and um, go in and save this as a zip file and we'll just put this as our test and um, yeah we'll go to desktop okay so and this will save us as a zip file and we just click export 
and we're almost done in the next video I'm gonna show you there's one little tweak that you gotta do on uh, the PHP code but it's very very simple and I'll show you how to go in and do that and then we'll go in and install it on WordPress and get you going and that's that's basically it so I'll see you in the next video